right. What's up, my guy? My name is Ethan Carroll. This video can be retransmitted and rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. I just want to know, like, um, what do you think happens after this life? I think we go to heaven and we have to and we follow the, the path of Jesus Christ, amen. Um, you gotta, you gotta follow him because he's the only way, the truth, and the life. And you, and for God so loved the world that He sent His only begotten Son, that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but will have eternal life. And so, like, do you think that everybody that sin is just going to be automatically disqualified from heaven? Uh, no, nah, not everybody. Uh, we could all uh, have salvation, but we uh, we got to accept that Jesus Christ died upon the cross for us, uh, that uh, for all of our sins, He shed His blood to clean our sins. Amen. Uh, Amen, man. Hey, and if you could see this real better than one way, what would it be? What do you mean? If you can see the world, like as a whole, the world that we're living in, yes. change in any one way, what would it be? Uh, everybody praising God. Everybody praising God? Yeah, that's what God wants. That's what He, he promised He was coming back, but He's kind of uh, delaying because he, there's a lot of people that are not saved and He wants all His sons to be saved. There are a lot of people out here huh, that have been saved, man. Like, I wonder, man, like if He didn't give the people who were never introduced to God a second chance. Uh, yeah, they, everybody gets a second chance and a third chance. Uh, God is merciful, and He will give all of us like a lot of chances. But we know we should just take advantage of that. The first chance that He gives us, we have to keep on going and, and follow Him. You gotta go with Him, huh, man? And so, like, man, if, if you if you could be remembered in any one way, what would it be? What do you mean? Like, if you could be remembered by the world forever. Remember? If you could be remembered forever. Remember. Yeah. I think, uh, like, what would you want to be remembered for? Uh, for lifting Jesus up. Lifting I'm Jesus up? Praising, praising Him. And, and I want to be the, the, the person that praises God the most. Uh, of course, I give Him the glory. He's, he's, he's worth the praise. Amen. Amen. And um, w w one more question, my guy. If you could invest in anything and money wasn't an issue, what would you invest in? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. If you could invest in anything for you to make money, for you and your family, and money wasn't a factor, what would it be? Missionary team? Restoration for the whole world to be saved. All right, man. Appreciate your time, bro. God bless you. God bless you. My name is Ethan Carroll. Uh, Gary. Gary. Okay. And um, this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. Just so you know. And uh, I'm gonna ask you a few basic questions. Yes. Sir. Um, what do you think happens after this life? Um, the afterlife. Yeah, I believe in like the Holy Ghost and God. In the Holy Ghost? Well, yeah, at least in the Holy Ghost and, and Jesus. There could be a God, I think. And, uh, so, like, do you believe in Hanford? Yeah, yes. Yeah. Like, uh, do you believe in heaven? Yes. You believe in heaven? So, like, do you think everybody that sins is just going to be disqualified from heaven? Um, well, they they might be in uh, purgatory or perdition, even. It would be, I think sometimes it, that, um, that maybe... There could be or could not be a hell, maybe, and that for some that they'll just be cut off eventually if they don't cut up. I'm not sure. So, like, do you think if someone was never introduced to, like, the Word of God that they're going to have an opportunity to be saved when it's all said and done? Yes. Okay. And um, if you could see Fresno better than any one way, what would it be? Fresno, California. Watch it. Come on, come on. Maybe more economically sound. More economically sound? How so? Like, more money for the public? Yeah, more people working and, and more people, less and people unemployed. More jobs for every people? Just like good jobs? Like, do you, do you feel like the government can make jobs for everybody? Um, not necessarily, maybe. But like, so like, what, what would you say is the best way to make jobs? Well, I think things will be looking up for us with the, um, the train maybe eventually and uh, construction maybe will pick up eventually. Construction a little bit? Okay. And um, if you could invest in anything and money wasn't a factor, what would you invest in to make profit for yourself? 
maybe technology. Technology, like what kind of technology? Um, better gas mileage vehicles or something. Just uh, it, things that can help uh, uh, reduce energy, uh, clean, cleaner, cleaner uh, green, green, green technologies. Okay, and um, if you could be remembered for any one accomplishment by the whole world, what would you be remembered for? Uh, world peace. World peace. Okay, and um, if you were given three last words right now, what would they be? God bless you. God bless you. Hey, thank you for your time, man. Appreciate that. This is Ethan Carroll speaking. Man, you could be anywhere you want to be, man, with the right amount of dedication, motivation, and determination. You could get there, man. You could be where you want to be. You could live the life that you want to live. You can accomplish your dreams. You can do it, my friends. You can do it. I got a few babies up, Grandma. I don't got too many, though. Mm -hmm. I don't got a lot of babies. I only got, I only got a few. I don't got too many babies. Yeah. Nah, I only got one right now. I see there's that one up there. That, that's her right there, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's the baby. There's it. Here's the yeah, that's the baby I was talking about. Uh-huh. That's her. See, there's the snowman. Yeah. That's it right there. Hey, Grandma. Man, I'm trying to be everything that I ever dreamed of being. <laughs> yeah? I'm trying to be everything. Everything I possibly can be. And he has, looks like he or she... Let me see that's her. That's what I started to say. It's her. Yeah. She's Definitely. perfectly satisfied. She is, yeah. That's how it ought to be. That's how it gotta be, man. All right, just so you know, just so you know, my name is Ethan Carroll, and um, this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted any way, shape, or form. All right, I'm gonna ask you some basic questions. All right, what do you think happens after this life? What happens after this life? Yeah, after this life that we're living on Earth right now. You get reborn again. Reborn again? Like, into what? Into a human or to like animal? It depends on what God wants you to be. Depending on what God wants you to be? Yeah. So like, do you believe in heaven and hell? Yes. You believe in heaven and hell? Yes. So like, do you think that, do you think the people that were never introduced to God are going to have a second chance to get to know Him? Yes. Because you know like, not everyone's introduced like to church, you know? The Bible tells you it's better to know me not to know me. And like, do you feel like everyone who committed a sin is just going to be automatically like tossed into the pit of fire? No. But you got you to gotta change to repent. You got to what? You got to change to repent. You got to repent? Yes. And like, alright, and um, if you could see Fresno better in any one way, what would it be? What do you mean? Like, if, if you could see better. Fresno better as a whole, like, as a city for everybody. For everybody that lives here. It's still be the same. Like, but if, if you could change anything about it, like, what would you change? Nothing. It'll be all the same. It's just better. It's just a little econ uh, economy. So, like, it would be like more jobs, for people. Yes. It's about more like, jobs, more you know, more 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 places for them to to, to live, you know. Like more. Fresno, Fresno is a big. It's a it's a small city, but it's not a big city to. Have a lot of people coming over here and a lot of people it, moving in. It's kind of big, man. Honestly, it's like it's like about it's about like about five hundred thousand people. You dig? Yeah, but it's not as big like LA and all that. Yeah, it's not as big as LA, though, man. Yeah. It's not as big as Chicago. It's not as big as New York. Fresno is just a little uh, a little hole, a little hole. You know, and people moving over here because it's more more it's more uh, calm calm living here. You know, it's calm down. You know, over here. Definitely. But, you know, it's like if we have more jobs, more people will move over here, and, and the city will grow bigger. Like if you have more entertainment, huh? Yeah. No, well, I don't know about the entertainment. It'd be more jobs here. And like, all right, man. Um, if if you could be remembered in any for for anything for any accomplishment, what would you want to be remembered for by the whole world? Remember, if the whole real could remember your name for, for like for, for for something you did, like what would you want to be remembered for? For the city of Fresno. For the city of Fresno? Yeah. Like what about it? 
Well, well, to, to, to help people out. To help people out over here in the Fresno? Yeah. Okay. Now, one more question. All right. If you could invest in anything, man, if money wasn't a factor, what would you invest in? Invest in the... Uh, and more, and to, uh, to make profit for yourself. Or to make profit to myself and to invest for the people? Yeah, and, and, and mainly for you, though. And more jobs. More, more jobs. jobs? Yeah. So, like, you would be the person that, that creates jobs? I would, I would try to help people out, yeah. Why not, huh? Yeah. A little help would go a long way, they say. I, I, I know a lot of people that are homeless and everything, and they need jobs, and, you know, you got to get them started somehow, you know. If you don't give them the opportunity, they're not going to get that job, that, that opportunity to, to get that job. But if Definitely. you give them the opportunity, then they'll get that job, and then they can work themselves. It's like going to school, you know. And a lot of people, they want that chance, but they don't give them that chance because they're homeless. You know, and they don't, That's just they fucked don't up, depend, huh? Yeah. They don't depend on them. You know, they say, nah, man, you're homeless, you're not going to show up. You don't give them that chance. You don't give them that opportunity to, to show them. I feel chance. like everyone deserves the opportunity yes. for a better future. Exactly. You know? Yeah. Like, regardless of what you've done, you feel me? Yeah. Regardless of your past history, regardless of all that. You feel me? All right, I got one final question for you, my guy. And then we're then we going to be good. Yeah. All right? If you could change the world right now, how would you change it? The real. The world. The like, world. The world we're living in. The world, if I would change it right now? If you could change anything about the world right now, what would you change? I wouldn't change nothing because God made this world and I won't go against God. Amen, man. Thank you for your time. Appreciate that, my guy. You feel me? All right, my guy. If you could define yourself, how would you define yourself? It's a um, challenge. Uh, um, and I'm um, currently unemployed. Currently unemployed? Like, are you looking for a job? Uh, eventually. Um, looking for a job? I'm trying to at least get a part-time job and see if, I can, if it works out for me. You ever thought about becoming an author? Um, no. I'm not, I don't know how to type. One thing. You don't know how to type? No, I'd be very slow. You know that they got a um, free college for everybody? Oh, that wonderful. It's called um, Universal Class. All you need is a library car, man any local library they got typing classes english classes real estate classes business classes you know and um it's available for whoever man honestly it's available for anyone that wants it well all right one more question if you could describe yourself in five words what would they be describe you as a person as a character as whatever you wanted to be described as that's so hard or the three words to describe you, who you are as a man. Helpful, um, happy, and blessed. Blessed, blessed to be living, huh? Yes, sir. Like, and man, one more, one more, one more. How do you think this world can be a better place as a whole? Like, how do you think this world can become a better place? You know, for everybody. If we got healthy, healthier. Healthier. Everyone got healthier? Yeah. All right, man. Appreciate your time. Thanks.